All right, today we're going to check out this Top Don 12 volt battery tester. Uh, it seems like the number of batteries that I have to diagnose and maintain continues to increase, so I thought this would be a handy tool for me to have, something that will quickly check the status of your charging system and battery, and that's what this does. Uh, I'll be sure to include a link down below to this product so you can uh, read additional reviews and check it out for yourself. All right, let's go ahead and hook it up to a couple of batteries and see what this thing does. All right, so I have the uh, tester hooked up to a battery here, and I'll just zoom in so you can see the screen. Okay, and this battery is just one that I have laying around. I use it in the winter to help boost my plow truck. Okay, let's run through the menus real quick here so we can kind of check out the options. We can select the language. Okay, out of vehicle or in vehicle. This one's out of the vehicle. Okay, select the uh, state of charge, before charge or after charge. And I don't, I haven't charged this probably since December or so, so we'll say before charge. Okay, regular flooded, but let's scroll through the options here. Okay, so you can see that it's pretty versatile. Uh, cold cranking amps. This one's a 650 amp, and I've already set that. It started out at 500s. And it's running the test. Okay, so that's a good battery. Let's go ahead and check out uh, some of the other options. All right, so I have it hooked up inside the uh, 2014 Sierra here. And you can see that the cables are fairly long, which is helpful. And the manual also states that it has polarity reversal protection, okay? Let's, uh, let's run through the actual cranking and charging test real quick. I'm going to leave that at 650 because I don't know what this battery actually is. Uh, it's probably more. Okay. So once it does that initial test in the vehicle, I'm going to hit OK. And it's telling me to start the engine here. Hopefully you'll be able to catch this. Okay, so it's basically uh, cranking normal. Tells me how many milliseconds. Uh, 9.88 volts. Hopefully the glare is not too much here. I'm going to say OK. And it's asking me if I want to do a charging test, which I do. Increase rev, which I can't do because I'm holding on here. Get some belt noise. Okay, so it basically told, tells me what uh, what my voltage is, charging output, and ripple is normal. Okay, so that's basically the Top Dawn battery tester. It's fairly inexpensive. I've got a link down below. Uh, check it out if you just want a quick tool that helps you diagnose uh, your battery and charging system. Uh, this just might be it. I'm going to go ahead and test it out on a four-wheeler here as well. All right, so I have it hooked up to the uh, Brute Force 750 here, and we'll zoom in for a closer look. Um, thanks for watching. Hopefully you found this video helpful. And if you did find it helpful, give me that thumbs up. That's always uh, appreciated. And that subscribe button is also right there if you want to hit it. Two forty. All right. Testing the battery. All right. It says it's a good battery. Let's see if it actually runs the uh, starting test on this one as well. All right, so it works on uh, four wheeler. Let's run the uh, charging test here. That's the cranking test. vibrating out of view here. I have to hold on to it. Increase rev is telling me to do here. Alright, there you 
there you go. Top Dawn battery tester. Uh, fairly inexpensive, easy to use, and it does a uh, basic thing. It tells you if the battery and charging system is in good shape. Hey, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. Have fun.